So today we have about 35 IT organizations across the university that are providing a breadth of services. The majority of expense is in core services, whether it be communication, email, phone, um, the, the core services that allow for communication across the university. We think that by working together with these IT organizations, we'll be able to consolidate those services, uh, bring them together, and offer them more efficiently to the organization. So moving forward, we need to be very wary of the rapid pace of change, and very cognizant of how quickly uh, the educational landscape is changing. Uh, we need to be fluid, but we need to move with caution. We need to um, recognize that our students and our faculty want different tools. They want to incorporate different pedagogy into their learning, but we also have to not sacrifice the quality of an Ohio State degree. And as we move forward, it'll be the marriage of these two things that will make us successful. Within Enterprise Applications, we are focused on providing the, the core business services um, in a more efficient way so as to move resources towards the academic research and outreach missions of the university. Uh, our technologies allow not only IT resources, uh, but all kinds of administrative resources to become more efficient and effective um, and securely support those functions. Transformational efforts happening across the university. Uh, within enrollment services, streamlining um, and simplification of processes. Within finance, a very similar effort of streamlining. Um, and in HR, not only streamlining and realigning their business processes, but an expansion of services into talent management, um, which is made up of performance management, recruitment, some other talent management functions. Um, in addition, we're making a very quick move into the mobile application space to try to serve our faculty, staff, and students where they are, where they live, where they work, um, as well as integrating technologies to pull in um, in a much more uh, mobile or much more agile way um, new technologies like College Scheduler like we've implemented in the, in the past quarter uh, that focus on students and how they do business. Our current services focus on bringing in HR, student, and finance data. We're expanding into grants, but that's in flight right now. But our vision is to encapsulate student life and other data sources, including research, to help everybody find the data they need. Most importantly, be able to trust it. So we're also focusing on data governance as we land all of those data sources. Secondarily is how do you access your data? Right now, a lot of people use e-reports, and it's pretty laborious, and it's very dated. We're now focusing on bringing up OB. This going to be a new business intelligence tool that'll provide drag and drop report creation ability. So in the future, you're going to have the ability to go to data you trust, drag and drop to create any reports, dashboards, or analytics you need, and have trust in the actual data you're seeing. So if you look, look at that complex environment that we have to manage from a security standpoint, we also need to layer on how are we effectively providing collaboration tools across the university um, to allow that collaboration, not just within Ohio, but from a global standpoint, when we've got researchers um, across the globe, how we, one, ensuring they have secure access to their data, um, we're actually protecting the sensitive, most restricted data from data security incidents, um, as well as providing that collaboration um, and ease of use that we want to, to promote that free flowing of information in the university like and feel. The IT community, I think that we could come together and, and provide um, a, stronger, a stronger set of tools around research. And that's something today that we are really depending on each researcher to really develop their own IT solutions. Um, some of the time, sometime really providing their own servers or learning how to really administer the technology themselves and not really focusing on the research and the core mission that they're really here sought out to do. So you can see all those challenges together um, really makes Ohio State a really complex environment, but it also does make it, um, you know, from the research data, from the, the private information restricted data, it really does make it a prime target as well from a 
from an individual, whether it be a, an, an individual looking to, to steal that information for their own use, um, or from, a, from a, a country actually looking to, to use some of our research to better promote some of their products in their country. Along those lines, I would also look at from the security services that we will be providing is making us come to more of a proactive um, state of security and compliance where we know where our restricted data resides. We've put those additional controls around that data. We know who's got access and we're allowing it in a free form way as we're only protecting the most restricted data. But that would allow us to proactively manage our compliance concerns and hopefully then help us reduce some of the reputational um, risks that we have in the environment today and some of the, you know, the, recent, the recent issues that we, we have seen um, across the environment. So again, the vision of information technology at the university is a very rich and a very exciting uh, vision. We see it as a uh, robust portfolio of services that um, offer an a la carte menu to our students, to our faculty and staff, and enable the core missions of the university.